the program that I did. It was it was about well, it was supposed to be eight months long. It, it wound up being seven, and it's, it was basically just a first year at Bible college, um, except a bunch of us lived out at a camp on Vancouver Island. Um, and especially once we got to like the end of that year, um, you know, seven months into the program, that's when COVID hit. It, it was hard for for me and for the rest of the class just to lose that last month of community that we had planned there. Um, but that actually turned out quite well at the end of the day because God really started working, particularly in myself, about um, how, how to interact with community, I guess. At the start of the summer, um, I was really unsure about whether or not to go back to camp this year. I had been going to camp um, past three years, I guess. Um, and working there over the summers, but you know, this year's different. There's COVID stuff. Most camps weren't even open. It was kind of hard to figure out if I should go, and if I if I do go, how long I should go, um, because the camp wanted people who were going for the whole summer, but I could really only go for about a month because my my sister was getting married. What wound up happening is I, I wound up going to camp, and I planned to go there for about a month, um, and my friend uh, Jeremy came along and. It was a really great time, but at the end of the day, um, our family had a crisis, didn't turn out well, I had to come back home, and this was after about two weeks of being at camp. That sounds really bad, but at the end of the day, that really was a blessing for my family, because if we hadn't been back home and preparing for my sister's wedding, I don't think we would have gotten stuff done in time. And that, that's really something that God's been showing to me over and over again this year, is just that He will allow us to go through Sometimes what we see as bad things, sometimes they are very much bad things, but he does it a lot of the time for our benefit. A lot of the difficult times God has planned and, and he, he knows what's going on. He's not just sitting in a corner by himself saying, and just ignoring your entire situation. He's there, he's sitting beside you, and he probably actually had a part in bringing you there to a certain extent. Um, now that's not always true, but a lot of the time it is. And so just, I would encourage them to just trust in God, uh, know that he's, he's beside you and that no matter what difficulty or trial may be going on in your life that, yeah, he's, he's alongside you and he wants to see you grow.